Xbox Game Pass user who can't launch Call of Duty, Black Ops 6 on the Xbox app or Microsoft Store, this video covers effective troubleshooting steps to resolve the problem so you can get back to playing. Follow along to fix launch issues, check compatibility, update your system, fix corrupt files, and more. First, press the Windows key plus R. Type devmgmt.msc and then press OK. Expand Display Adapters. Right-click your display adapter. Select Properties. Go to the Driver tab. Click on Update Driver. Click on Search Automatically for Driver Software. Wait for the update to be installed. You can also click on Search for updated drivers on Windows Update. First, Google GeForce Experience. Click on GeForce Experience. Press Download Now. Save the file. Run the installer. Press Yes. Now install the program. First open the link that you will find in the description of this video. Click on Downloadable Version. Click on Download the Gaming Services Repair Tool for PC. Wait for the repair to be downloaded. Right-click the tool and select Run Administrator. Select Yes. Now wait for the tool to repair your Xbox app. If the tool worked, then type Y and then press Enter. Open your Xbox app. Select Call of Duty. Click on the three dots. Select Manage. Open the Files tab. 
click on check for updates. This will check for updates in case there's a new update that will resolve your issue. If that didn't work, select verify and repair. Choosing to verify and repair your files will reset Call of Duty Black Ops 6 to its original settings. You won't retain any mod files and game saves that aren't backed up may also be lost. Do you want to continue? Press yes. Now wait for Call of Duty Black Ops 6 to be scanned for errors. Now launch Call of Duty. First, open the Start menu and type PowerShell. Right-click PowerShell and select Run as Administrator. Press Yes. Copy the first command that you'll find in the description of this video. Right-click the frame of your PowerShell window and select Edit. Now select Paste. Press Enter. Copy the second command that you'll find in the description of this video. Right Click the frame of your PowerShell window and select Edit. Now select Paste. To press Enter. Wait for the Microsoft Store to be reinstalled. Type exit then press enter. Now open your start menu. Type Microsoft Store. Right click Microsoft Store and select pin to taskbar. Now open your store. First open the start menu, open your settings, open apps, open the installed app section, locate Call of Duty, click on the three dots to open the Call of Duty options, click on advanced options, look for the reset section. If Call of Duty Black Ops 6 isn't working right, you can try to repair it. Call of Duty Black Ops 6 data won't be affected. Now press Repair. If Call of Duty Black Ops 6 is still not working right, reset it. The app's data will be deleted. Now press the Reset button. This will permanently delete Call of Duty Black Ops 6 data on this device, including preferences and sign-in details. Press Reset again. First, Google GeForce Experience. Click on GeForce Experience. Press Download Now. Save the file. Run the installer. Press yes. Now install the program. First, open Start and open Settings.
Click on Apps. Click on Apps and Features. Locate Microsoft Store. Click on the three dots. Click on Advanced Options. Click on Repair. Wait for your store to be repaired. If that didn't work, click on Reset. Press Reset. Wait for your store to reset. Now launch the store. First open the Start menu then open Settings. Open Apps. Open Apps and Features. Locate Xbox. Click on the three dots. Click on Advanced Options. Locate Reset and select Repair. If that didn't work, click on Reset. Press Reset. If that didn't work, press Uninstall. Press Uninstall. Close your Windows settings. Search for your Xbox app. Select Xbox app. Press Get. Wait for the app to be downloaded and installed. Press Open. Sign in to your account or press Browse the Catalog. First, open the Start menu. Type PowerShell. Press Run as Administrator. Press Yes. Copy the first command that you will find in the description of this video. Right-click the PowerShell frame and select Edit. Select Paste. Now press Enter to uninstall gaming services. Copy the second command that you will find in the description of this video. Right-click PowerShell and select Edit. Click on Paste. Now press Enter. 
Press Get to download gaming services. Press Yes. Wait for gaming services to be downloaded and installed. Now gaming services should be installed. Type exit and then press enter. First open the link that you'll find in the description of this video. Go to Create Windows 11 Installation Media and press Download Now. Double click the file you just downloaded. Press Yes. Press Accept. Select your language and edition. Press Next. Select ISO file. Press Next. Save it as Windows 11. Wait for the file to be downloaded. Press Finish. Double click the Windows 11 ISO file. Click on Setup. Press Yes. Press Next. Press Accept. Select Keep Personal Files. Press Install. Wait for your PC to be updated.